How's it going, everyone? My name is Jake with Trade Confident. Today, I'm going to be talking about Cardano. I know we've been providing a lot of updates on this, but we are really, really close to that Vassal hard fork. It looks like everything is a go, and we are very close to the point where the hard fork is actually going to happen. We have some updates from Charles Hoskinson himself, so let's dive right into that. Cardano creator Charles Hoskinson gives update on big Vassal hard fork reveals new timeline. Cardano creator Charles Hoskinson is giving an update on the highly anticipated Vassal hard fork for the Ethereum Rivals blockchain. In a new video update, Hoskinson says the major crypto exchanges are currently working on the new Cardano hard fork and he expects more to follow. So the next major lift is to get the exchanges on board. Binance is reporting that we're currently upgrading. By volume, I think they're about 30 to 40% of the Cardano trade volume. And other than that, Kraken and Coinbase and so forth tend to follow along. Generally what happens is that after a hard fork date is announced, you see a big rush of people push through. So what is probably going to occur is that once we hit that golden 75% of stake pool operators and three to five of the major exchanges by volume, the top three to five are upgraded or in the process of upgrading, a hard fork date will be set. Then the rest of the exchanges feel the urgency and they start upgrading and it's really hard to get them otherwise. They tend to need a little bit of a push for that. Hoskinson says that Cardano developers are making steady progress and that the hard fork should go through at some point in, this, in September. Overall, this is great news. It sounds like Charles Hoskinson is expecting the hard fork to happen sometime in September. All we need to happen is 75% of the stake pool operators to have transferred over to the new code. Once that happens, the top three to five exchanges, once they are either upgrading or have fully upgraded, that's when the hard fork date should set. And we will provide you guys the news as soon as that happens. That'll be really important for anyone that is currently holding Cardano. With that, let's jump into the technical analysis of it. Right now, I'm looking at Cardano ADA on the top and bottom finder metric, last updated today, August 29th. Here we're seeing a buy signal that is just printed, and I want to reiterate, we're going to be saying this over and over again, this candle has not closed yet. And once it closes, once the buy signal is on the second candle, it will be official, that will be an official buy signal, and you are good to trade that if you would like to take the risk. With that in mind though, we are not getting any green bars here. This shows me that we don't really have a confirmation for a buy signal. And I will say, just spoiler alert, we have moved up a little bit um, and we likely honestly won't get those green bars here. So I would hesitate, unless you're already in, I would hesitate to follow this buy signal. That's just me, I'm not providing financial advice. If you'd like to take that risk, go for it and good luck in your trades there. Checking out the live charts here, I'm looking at ADA USD on the four hour time frame. My top and bottom finder has a signal strength set to 10. Right now I'm seeing a buy signal that happened at about five o'clock last night. That would be five o'clock Pacific Standard Time on uh, August 28th. At this time, the trend exhaustion was in the inner bottom section. So this isn't a full signal that just shows that a move up was likely. At the same time, the price versus well money flow was spiking up. It was going up crazy fast and has since leveled off in the few hour in the few candles between then and now. Uh, this was kind of a high risk trade, but it looks like if you had taken it, you would have made profit there. So congrats on anybody that was able to catch this and enter a trade. The next point of resistance, now that we've hit right here, if we pass through this and break out, the next point that we're gonna be looking at is about 46 cents. This will be about a 40% move up. Uh, just call it an even 47 cents at this take profit line. That'll be a solid point of resistance here. Um, and I don't expect this to break any further, but if it does, it'll just likely reach the top here at about 48 cents. But I think for now, if we break out of this resistance line, I do think 46 cents is about where we're gonna end up. Of course, this mostly depends on what the rest of the market looks like. If Bitcoin is gonna see much larger moves up, the rest of the market is probably gonna follow. The other thing to keep in account is uh, ADA is gonna be acting a little bit differently with this Vassal hard fork coming up. So we will need to pay very close attention to the price action of ADA. Thanks so much for watching everyone. I really, really appreciate it. If you enjoy this video, please leave a like and subscribe. It helps our channel grow. And if you wanna learn more, if you wanna keep growing as a trader and follow along with our trades directly, you're gonna to wanna to grab a membership at the link in the description. We actually just won a brand new trade over the weekend with many more to come. So if you wanna follow along with us, 
Just follow that link in the description. You'll be able to check out our scalping record at this link. You can watch our strategy video to see if our trading strategy aligns with yours. And if you really like our risk management, if you like how this works, you're gonna grab a monthly membership. This will give you access to all trade calls, masterclass courses, the live community chat so you can talk with other trade confident members and live coaching calls every single month. We just had one this last Thursday and it was an absolute blast. We had a lot of fun talking with everyone. From there, you're gonna to wanna to join the Telegram service just so you can get active updates on any sort of trade calls or company updates. With that in mind, thank you so much for watching. Remember, trade safe, trade confident, and I'll see you in the next video.